And we back! Y'all know I love talking about basketball. I have an entire channel where I do exactly that. But there's one place where I refuse to have any basketball conversations, and that's the barbershops. Some of y'all understand this, some of y'all don't, man. But the barbershop is a fun place to sit down and listen, but I hate being a part of because you get some of the wildest takes in basketball history. And one I hear often when I'm at the barbershop is, LeBron James wouldn't last a minute in the 90s. I don't, I don't understand it, but in today's video, we are putting it to the test because I took a rookie version of LeBron and I found a roster that is set in 1995 and I'm colliding the two. How will LeBron fare in the 90s? We'll find out today. My goal for 2022 is to break all of my like records from the previous year and I need your help to do that. So be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Let's get into it. So you're looking at me and saying, Kenny, this looks extremely different than any other 2K22 video you've done on your channel. And you're absolutely right. Because in order for me to find a somewhat realistic or decently realistic um, version of the NBA in the 90s, I had to go back on the PC. And unfortunately, the PC community did not get the next gen upgrade. But there are so many great talented modders out there. I'll leave some in the description if you want to do this yourself on your PC. But it does look a little bit different. But that is completely okay because the person that created this roster went pretty in depth when it comes to making things happen. Now, this is the 1999-1996 season. What we're going to do is simulate this first year and then bring LeBron in as a rookie. The 1996 draft was already considered one of the greatest, if not the greatest draft class of all time, and now LeBron James is in it with Allen Iverson, Stephon Marbury, Kobe Bryant, the list goes on and on, Steve Naz, Ray Allen, there's so many talented players here, and now you have LeBron James too. So quickly, I'm going to go through every single team. You're going to notice that there is a difference in overall. I did not create these rosters, so don't be mad at me if you see somebody that's too high or too low. But I think that the, the creator of this was going for it. They wanted the elite of the elite to feel like the elite of the elite. So MJ is a 96, and that's going to be the highest in the entire league. But like some teams, like Dino Raja is only a 79, and that's the best that the Boston Celtics have. So keep that in mind. The, the elite of the elite are going to feel like the elite of the elite. And we're going to see if LeBron James can hang. What we're going to do is we're going to draft him in a 1996 draft. We're going to simulate four years of his career and see how he holds up. Now, since we are on the PC, um, I know on next gen, you can literally take a team out of the association. We could have had now with 29 teams, but on PC, they don't allow you to literally delete a team. So the Pelicans are a team here. What I'm going to do is force the Pelicans to trade all their picks away because um, I don't want anybody to get drafted here when this is supposed to be a team that doesn't exist. You feel me? So that's that. And I'm just super excited to see what can happen, man. Will LeBron James be able to hold up in the 1990s? I'm going to spoil it for you. I'm going to assume that he will. But this is supposed to be just a fun little video. I want you to leave a like. If you want to see me do another challenge here, right? Um, not a challenge, but me to a full NBA reset from 1995 with these rosters. Leave a like and comment down below. Because in this video, we're solely, we are solely focusing on LeBron James. Who's going to get these picks? I think I'm just going to randomly select the team, close my eyes, and be like, boom, the Miami Heat get this pick. And I'm going to do this for all of their picks uh, just just because. I just I would hate for LeBron to get drafted to this team. And, um, well, he has to play with roster fillers, and it's a, a rebuild. Not even a rebuild a team. It's, it's worse than a rebuild a team. And now that I think about it, since the Heat got that pick, um, they just hit the double lottery. Because you talk about a team that have nothing but 40 overall players. Retro filler has three positions. Do you see that? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. That doesn't exist in next gen. I don't look at I downloaded some mods. I downloaded some rosters. I don't know if this is one of the mods I downloaded, but he has three positions. In 2K22 next gen, LeBron can only be a small four power four. He does not get to be a third string point guard. It's very interesting. I wonder if that's in the actual game or something I download. I literally don't know. All right, so yeah, we don't care about this first year, so we're gonna completely simulate and get things going next year when LeBron enters the NBA draft. Will he get drafted number one? He probably will, but he's got some competition. There's, again, Kobe, Allen Iverson, Steve Nash. There's so many great people in this draft class. Carmelo won MVP. Rasheed Wallace, Rookie of the Year. Tony Kuko, Sixth Man of the Year. Dikembe Mutombo, Defensive Player of the Year. And Grant Hill wins Most Improved. Um, Paul Westfall ends up winning Coach of the Year here on NBA teams. No MJ, huh? No MJ. No MJ. Third team? Michael Jordan, third team? Oh, yeah. This 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 roster ain't, ain't right. Who's going to win this championship that we don't care about? Chicago Bulls do this since they disrespecting. You're the GOAT. 
Michael Jordan. Nope, it's going to be the Detroit Pistons because Grant Hill will not have to suffer any injuries in this. And he had a triple-double in that closeout game that went to OT and they won by one. Jeez, all right, okay. Draft lottery, here's the moment of truth. The Miami Heat have that potential first overall pick, but it's gonna go to the Toronto Raptors. The Hawks, the Celtics, the Bucks, and the Heat complete the top five. Will LeBron be drafted first overall? We will find out now. Okay. All right. Toronto, do you get a savior? I mean, it is LeBronto. It was LeBronto. And it will be LeBronto. LeBron James gets drafted to the Toronto Raptors. is the best thing that could have happened to their association, bro. I saw a number of people in the media suggesting that James is a second-round talent. I couldn't disagree more. Who in the world saw LeBron it was like, ah, oh, that man don't deserve to be one of the top 30 picks in the draft. Um, but it is LeBron. You got Marcus Camby, number two. Allen Iverson going to the Celtics. Kobe going to the Bucks, And then the Heat ended up with um, Steve Nash. We don't care about nothing other than LeBron James in Toronto for this video. Um, I don't even remember who's on Toronto. The Mighty Mouse is still here. Oliver Miller is here. Willie Anderson. Tracy Murray. I don't know why. I, was, I saw Tracy and M and was thinking, wait, am I great? He's in town? No, he is absolutely not in town. Um, so let's see if they do anything in free agency. Oh, this will be the team that he plays with this season. Um, it is the team he plays with this season. All right. They didn't do anything. Spo Webb is a little bit worse. They signed him, though. Spo Webb, welcome to, <laughs> welcome to the team, Sure King. All right. LeBron, this is your roster. Good luck. I, I wish y'all well, my boy. Just go out there and put up crazy stats as a rookie so people can stop saying, oh, will he be able to last? He's already getting great minutes because he is the best player on the team. First game of his NBA career is in with the Cleveland Cavaliers. He's at his home city, town, state. And he put up 23, 4, and 5 in his first game, and they lost by 2. Game 2, going against the Celtics, who have Allen Iverson. AI in his second game ended up with 34, 7, and 3. And Braun struggled and ended up with 19 and 6. Game, when are y'all going to y'all gonna win any? You going to win any games this season? Oh, no, you're not because you want to go out there and get the next year's first overall pick because you want help. I respect that. The 1997 draft class has Tim Duncan, doesn't it? 19, yeah, it has Tim Duncan. He's tanking for Tim. That's what it is. Let's tank for Tim. And, yeah, they're, they're – all right, Braun, let's, let's, let's put up a crazy game. There's a win. And it wasn't even LeBron. <laughs> it was P.J. Brown, out of all people, to come in with 23. All right. So, first year, I don't think... I think first year is going to be a wash for a lot of lottery picks, okay? He probably is going to put up some good stats for a rookie. But this is not a playoff team, as you know. And it could end up winning the lottery and get Tim Duncan. And then, and bada boo, bada bam, the team is great in just two years. Kevin Garnett wins MVP. LeBron James wins rookie of the year. You kind of expected that, right? 24, 6, and 4, and a half. A steal and a half. And le a little less than a block. Jim Jackson wins six man of the year. Lonzo Moore, the defensive player of the year. Daniel Marshall, most improved, which makes me happy. Rest in peace to Flip Saunders, he won coach of the year with the Timberwolves. And just like that, KG got that team looking amazing. Um, I'm guessing he didn't make an NBA team as a rookie. He did not, but he did end up on that first team with a bunch of great players. This team is not good. They won 24 or 34 total games. So, you know, not great. But it was just his rookie season. And 34 is actually more than what they were on pace for when the last time we talked. So that is a good sign that maybe next year they're a lot better. Um, and they're probably going to have some money to spend in free agency. So a lot of things can happen. Kevin Garnett brings a championship to Minnesota. I was not going. I was going to say single-handedly, but in the closeout game, it was uh, Terry Porter. It was Tom Gugliotta. It was Christian Leitner. KG was just kind of there. Six attempts. Oh, he fouled out. That's, that's what it was. But they won, and that's all that really matters. Actually, they're all the way back in ninth. So that KG dream is dead, dead. Oh, not KG. That Tim Duncan dream is dead, dead. But hey. Um, I, I don't know who they're going to end up with, but it might be somebody nice. How much will LeBron James get better? He jumps up six. Okay. I don't know who this guy is, but he jumped up five. They brought in Arvita Sabonis, but he's 32 and he drops two. So, um, Dino Raja, was he here last season? He was not. So, that's another guy that they signed. All right. At least they tried to spend some... They tried to spend... Greg Anthony was not here last season. They tried to spend some money to make the team better. I don't know if they succeeded in doing that, but they tried to. I mean, this team is better than it was last year. That's that's something that we can look at it. Um, well, that's the one way we can look at it. Um, and you know what? It might be a playoff team. You know what? This might be a playoff team. P.J. Brown. You know what? 
I know in the 90s, everybody was running super big. You know what I'm saying? P.J. Brown is a six, or I'm sorry, a seven, one, a seven, one power forward, as you see. You're moving to the bench because we're letting young LeBron James run the three. And we're going to have this guy. What the heck? We're going to have Franklin McCarthy end up at the small four. So we got Mighty Mouse, Anderson Galloway, who's a guy that exists. We just drafted this dude. Franklin McCarthy, LeBron James, and Arvita Sabonis. PJ Brown, Dino Raja, Greg Anthony, Homer. 90% of these people I have no idea who they are. And you know what I want to do? Where do we where do we go against the Chicago Bulls? Yeah, we got we gotta go to Chicago. So I'm gonna simulate to the end, and we about to see LeBron go head to head with Michael Jordan. And I thought this might have been a playoff team, but I guess not. These guys are not very good. So we played against them at home. And LeBron didn't have a good game at all. Only 29 minutes in a game where he was not even in foul trouble. So I don't know what the heck happened there. But they ended up winning. Beating LeBron, uh, beating MJ and, and um, Scotty. What I do like about this is a lot of these games be having 90s feel. Oh, I guess, okay. Maybe this is the only game that had a 90s feel. 99 to 82? What the heck? Okay, but now we're in Chicago. And the Bo almighty Bulls ain't even that good. They got Derek Fisher. They got Derek Coleman. They got two different Derek spelled differently. And, and But they're not even 500. This team is a sub-500 team. But they got MJ. So, I, so I'm curious. Okay, so it wasn't even really close. Again, I guess we got their number. Do we go against them? We have to go against them at least one more time this season. The team is, is doing okay. They're teetering around 500. They're above 500 now. This is a playoff team. It, all it took was Arvita Sabonis to be added to the team. We're better than the Bulls, y'all. All right, please be close, because I just want to see LeBron and MJ on the court together. It's not close. Come on, Bulls. Come on, Bulls. Y'all got to be better. Either way, we're going to see LeBron James in the playoff series very early in his career, which makes sense. He's LeBron. Jason Kidd wins MVP. Tim Duncan wins Rookie of the Year in Atlanta out of all places. Kendall G Gill wins Sixth Man of the Year. Um, Kevin Garnett, Defense Player of the Year. Eric Walker. Okay, Sidney Lowe. They win 72 games. What the heck? Is LeBron an NBA player yet? He is not. The Bulls are the seventh seed. We are the sixth seed. I hope that the Bulls, when they play in, man, they do. Okay. All right. We're going against the Orlando Magic, Penny Hardaway, and Shaquille O'Neal. Now, they had a little crossroads because that first year, the 1996 draft class was the year that Shaq became a free agent and he re-signed. They got Penny Hardaway. They got Sharif Abdul-Rahim. Dennis Scott is still there and some dude that's auto-generated. They they got a brick, man. They're the three seed. We're the six seed. So I'm going to simcast these because I want to jump in and watch LeBron James work some magic. You get it? Because we're going against the magic? I didn't even think about that was off the That was off the cuff, y'all. I'm not even that lyrically talented. But sometimes it just happened. What am I talking about? Lyrically talented? Stop it. All right, but let's get into it, y'all. And it looks, um, it looks okay. It looks fine. We even got the old school TNT logos down here that you can't, you can't see. But trust me, okay? Bron is over there at 23. They give it down to McCarthy who dunks the ball. And that makes it a two-point game with 50 seconds to go. Penny Hardaway brings the ball to the court, being guarded by Greg Anthony. I don't know where Mighty Mouse is. He might be in foul trouble. Dino Raja, great defense, and now LeBron James has the ball. Game one of the first round of the playoffs. Can they pull off an upset? Greg Anthony going at Penny Hardaway. A huge size difference. Don't go up with that. Or do! Get, get big, Penny! Get big, Penny! You're not ready. You're not ready for what Greg Anthony can do, I guess. I guess. Greg Anthony is just built different. There's 26 seconds left on the clock. He got it right back. One possession left in this game. Down by two. Some of these people's faces are, are scary. Shaq is young. He's got the hair still. That's kind of wild. Damon Stoudemire's in the game and LeBron James isn't. Okay, just go at Penny Hardaway's head, I guess. It don't matter how tall you are. Just go at Penny Hardaway's head. I, th I don't understand 2K's logic. Our, we have the one of the best players in the league. He's only a year number two, but he's one of the best players in the league. You just completely take him out in a closeout, well, I guess, game one situation? I don't understand. I just, just don't understand that. Is he back on the court for defense? He's not even on the court for defense. But Mighty Mouse is. Mighty Mouse, I love you, my boy, but you should not be on the court right now. The guy you are guarding is 6'6", six, 6'7", six, six, maybe. It's Penny. He's going to walk to the basket. 
Four seconds to go. Three seconds to go. Penny Hardaway draws a foul with two seconds left on the clock. Wow. Penny, is he going to make his free throws? One is up, and it's good. It's money. I can't tell if the um, if the Raptors have a, a timeout. We will find out in a second. Penny Hardaway shot number two is up, and it's good. And by the way they are moving, they do not have a timeout, and LeBron James is on the sideline. I repeat, the best player on the team is in this on the sideline. They I just don't understand it. This is that that was bad. That was bad. That was bad. We went in there to look at Le, watch LeBron James and he was the best player on the court for us. He was a plus one. We got a minus 16 from McCarthy. Hello? I don't understand how he doesn't end up on the court right there, coach. Whoever the coach is needs to be fired. Can him. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. He don't he shouldn't be here. It is a 3-2 series in the favor of the Toronto Raptors. Can they close this series out? Not in this one. It is going to a game seven. LeBron only have an eight. I mean, a lot of these games are giving the the 1990s feel where it's a super low scoring game, which I'm fine with. I'm cool with that. It's supposed to be the 90s. But I want to see LeBron put up some crazy stats. They're up by 10 with three minutes to go. Will they be able to close it out? It looks like they will. And an upset has happened. The six seeded. Toronto Raptors, LeBron toe is real, 29 and 8 in that game seven. And just like that, they're moving on to go against the number two seed who have Kobe. And Hakeem Elijah won. And Vin Baker and Glenn Robinson. And this team is really, really good, y'all. This team is really, really good. Alright, let's see if they can win it. So yeah, embarrassing, embarrassing losses here. Um, they lost by a million points, so that's not great. I mean, some some games are yours and some games aren't. You know, it looks like they're winning this one. All right, it's a. Oh, did they win that or they lose that? They won that. Okay, they were down two two zero and now they make it a series. They gotta win this one too though. They gotta win this one too. It is close. No, it's not. They gotta win one more on the win one on the road and this is your series. Win one on the road. And this is just, is Lebronto. Nope. They did it. I I, swear, I don't know what just happened. I thought that was the end, but it was not. They're one game away from being in the conference finals as the sixth seed. The Toronto Raptors with LeBron James. How will he fare in the 90s? It looks like he'll be just fine because he just led a team to the conference finals to go against the five-seeded Cleveland Cavaliers who have Terrell Brandon, Dikembe Mutombo, Bob Sura, and Tyrone Hill. We're better. We're better. LeBron, he wins game one. I don't know who you are, but coming off the bench and dropping 20 on 18 minutes with seven rebounds, that's elite. Two. Y'all, we might see LeBron in the finals in his second year. Is this year number two? This is year number two. We're about to see LeBron in the finals. They're in the finals to go against the Rockets, who are the six seed. Two six seeds in the finals. That cannot have been done before. They have Sam Cassell. They have Cliff Robinson, and they have uh, um, Alonzo Mourning. And they've been dominating low-key. They want a sweep. They lost one game in their entire playoff run. So this is not a team to be taken lightly at all. But they make it work. I will not jump into a game unless it is close or it's like the closeout and we about to see LeBron raise the trophy. Let me slow things down just a little bit so I'll know when to jump in or if I need to jump in. It's a 10-point game. That's not close enough. Seven points with two minutes to go. Not close. What the heck just happened? Game log. We got to look at the game log, y'all. It wasn't close. It wasn't close. It wasn't close. It was an eight-point game with two minutes to go. Who? LeBron made a made two free throws. Dino Raja hit a jump shot. LeBron made a layup with 40 seconds to go. McCarthy hit a three. He only had five points in his game. And, and three of them were with 20 seconds to go. And the game winner, LeBron James dunked the ball. <laughs> this is a LeBron James video. And I just missed him. I just missed him win a game in the finals. Because it didn't look like they had a chance. It's my fault, but it ain't. You feel me? Like, this is a 16-point game. They're not coming back from this, right? Okay, they didn't. 
I mean, bro. Oh my God, Alonzo Mourning. Jesus Christ. You did not have to do it like that. Okay. I am being extra particular about the speed once we get to the fourth quarter. I mean, they're one game away. They're one game away, y'all. They're just one game away. Please be a close one at least, though. It's the fourth quarter, and it's not very close. Ten-point game with four minutes to go. LeBron is going to win the championship in the 90s. He's going to win the championship in the 90s. Wow. How will he fare in the 90s, bro? Immediately came in. You're number dos. Number two. And they won the championship. Do you remember how this season started? They were like four and eight to start the season. And they're going to win a championship. LeBron is on the court for two, 17, six, and four. This feels weird. I mean, this feels weird. It don't feel like, oh, LeBron. Okay. Good rebound. Good rebound. Good rebound. Reset that shot clock. Uh-huh. Sabonis. Go ahead. Get you a ring, my boy. LeBron, get you a ring, my boy. The NBA Finals. LeBron James. He's wearing, like, super crazy technology sneakers. It's not these 1990 sneakers. It's, it's his own. Dribble it out, Mighty Mouse. You know what? No, LeBron, you deserve it. Dribble it out, my boy. This is your finals MVP. This is your moment. You're number two, and you all read. It looks like you would have fared better in the 90s than in the 2000s. Because how long did it take you in the 2000s? It took you almost a decade. You were like your number eight when you won your first championship. And this time, you win it in just your number two. Look at the Toronto Raptors. P.J. Brown, Arvidas Sabonis, Mighty Mouse, Damon Stoudemire. And look at those two dudes. LeBron won a championship. That's insane. I, I should end the video off right here. It only took two years. But I won't because I want to see if he can put up some crazy stats. And look at the celebrations. Why is Damon Stoudemire so much smaller than everybody else? Um, LeBron was holding the Finals MVP trophy, but he's not with the team. Mighty Mouse will legit... What do they got him listed at in this game? 5'10"? He do not look like 5'10 in those pictures. He looks 5'7". He looks he looks like me right out there. And LeBron James averages 21-7-3 in the 90s. And he goes on to win finals MVP. That is great. That is very, very great for him. How much better will he get? We're about to find out. Will, will they have money in free agency? I have no idea. Will the team get better? I have no idea. LeBron is jumping up four. He is now up to a 94 and they got Jalen Rose on the team now. Um, so I guess Jalen Rose is running shooting guard with Franklin McCarthy at the three and then LeBron at the four and then George Mirasan at the five. Sabonis is getting worse, but hey, he won a championship already. You're not really worried about him uh, regressing. All right, that's exciting stuff, man. New start Atlanta looks elite. Look at it. All right, first game with this new team or same team, but... Different pieces, they lose to Kobe. Kobe get a little bit of revenge. Close to a 5x5 five five game for LeBron. He needed a couple more steals, so that's kind of crazy. Game number two. Oh, this is oh, this is Bron's MVP season. Bet. Yeah, this is Bron's MVP season. Sit back, relax, and watch these boys go to work. Because this is MVP. You're number three MVP. I'm seeing it. Oh, it wasn't LeBron James's MVP season because KG's got that. Okay, KG, do your thing, big fella. I see you. Bron is on their first team. No, he averaged 26 and a half. Somebody said they hate the way I round, round up and down, uh, whatever. He averaged some very good stats. How about that? You agree on that? Cool. And he was all defensive in year number three. Um, we're, I, they were the one seed, so that's great too. Can they go back to back? First round of going against the Atlanta Hawks. This team has Tim Duncan and Marcus Camby down low. Okay. But we got Braun down low. And right now, Braun only took five. Orlando Magic, they're going at it again. They're going at it again. Can this be revenge for the Orlando Magic? I do not know. Game one is a loss. I'm going to do it like this instead of sim casting. Um, oh. Oh, Braun. What's up, bro? Oh, you can't. It looks like you're putting up some a stinker or two. Are you getting eliminated? Oh, a sweep in the second round to Dennis Scott, Benny Hardaway, and Shaq. Not the greatest of times. Jason Kidd wins in Finals MVP. Um, okay. That throwaway season. Throwaway season, Bron. Don't worry about it. You was just mad that they didn't give you that MVP award. This is your year. Because this is the 1990... The 1999 draft. 
next year's the 2020 draft or 2000 draft so this is the last year of the video go out with a bang go out with a bang go win a championship or something man you need it you, i guess you don't need it you already proved that you'd be all right but like it would help two championships in just three four years time what is this what does the starting lineup look like nowadays it's lebron okay okay i can we can rock with this mccarthy come off the bench he could be the sixth man of the year here we go game one pacers win braun 31 7 and 6 this is lebron's mvp season yeah this is lebron's mvp season watch it watch it this game it was a low scoring game lebron put up only 20 but come on man look at the stats oh his field goal percentage is down but look at the stats i think this is mvp season kg ended up in boston what the heck that's crazy that's wild now it happened way earlier than what it did in real life for sure but he ended up in boston and he won another mvp award um sean kemp is with the seattle supersonics i don't know how they ended up the thunder already shaq defensive player of the year mike baby wins most approved i guess we will not get the the champ oh no not the championship but the mvp Braun. he's second team this year round his numbers are slightly down. I thought this was about to be a championship run, but it was not. That's all good. I mean, well, it might be a championship run. I thought it was going to be an MVP run, but it might be a championship run. They are the two seed. They're going to get the Cleveland Cavaliers in the first round. We've been here before. They got Larry Hughes, Corey Maggette, the Kimbe Mutombo, and Daryl Armstrong. All right, we got that. That ain't no big deal. Simulate the entire round. Boom. Sweep them. Washington Wizards have Seaway up. Tracy Gilbert? Okay. And, okay, Seaway up, Lucius Harris, and a bunch of auto-generated people. All right. C-Web is kind of elite is what I'm saying. We win game one. McCarthy off the bench? Okay. I mean, if McCarthy giving us that type of production, if Mc okay, he didn't he, he, he didn't do it this this game, but he was all right. He had four threes. Game three, we lose that. Didn't expect to sweep. C-Web is kind of a different beast nowadays. Come on, give us give us a... Oh. Don't want to get out in the first round again, Bron. They, oh, not in the second round again. Not like last year. All right, conference finals. Going against the Boston Celtics, who have MVP KG. And they have Chauncey. And they have Allen Iverson. Great. Absolutely great. Okay. I want to 100% jump into one of these games. um, Because the MVP, Kevin Garnett, is there. And, and LeBron's like, hey, that should have been my award. So we're going to give LeBron the opportunity to guard Kevin Garnett. We're going to jump into one of these games. Please be close. I'm going to be watching. Almost a 10-point game. But it's a comeback for us. LeBron with a 40 piece. You love to see it. All right, here we go. Come on. Give, give us a game, man. Stop with these blowouts. Yep, that's another one. I can't, I can't do anything about it, y'all. Now, I don't want me to jump into a game that's already out of reach because there's no suspense. Please be close with three minutes to go. When three minutes hit, that's when I feel confident and jumping into a game. Five point game? Uh, seven. We still will jump in. We still will jump in. Seven point game. We have won this second half. We, we won this fourth quarter by 20-plus points already. You know what I'm saying? We just got to keep our foot on that throat, and we can uh, potentially walk out of here with another win. Bron is in that point guard right now. I love it. I love it. We gave him his third position. That's point guard. They're running a huge lineup. Good defense right there by, Mac I think that was McCarthy. So you got Bron at the one, McCarthy at the two, Tyrone Hill at the three, P.J. Brown at the four. No, actually, no. This lineup sucks. Coach, what is you on? You trying to sell the game? They give it down to Moore. I don't think they see how you pronounce that, but maybe it is. Allen Iverson for three. No good. Rebound Kevin Garnett and LeBron and KG going at each other. And KG with the bucket. Brings it down to a five-point game with just two minutes to go. I decided I wanted to showcase some of the great mods out there. You can see we got the old school TNT little thing in the corner. Um, and since this is the last year, I don't mind being on this side. It always feels weird when I'm on this side of the video personally. Uh, LeBron James is the player of the game so far. He's got 25 points shooting um, 8 for 11 from the field. Arvita Sabonis is bringing the ball up to Corey. He was one of the best playmaking big men of all time, so I guess he could be the point center like he's Nikola Jokic. Okay, LeBron is no longer at the one. I don't think... It looks like he still might be at, one, at the one, and Greg Anthony is at, like, the two, maybe? I don't I don't know how the lineup is... Actually, can I look at that? I can't because I'm not controlling teams. Um, but KG and LeBron going at each other is, is primetime television right now. I love to see that they're guarding each other at the moment. Which kind of tells me that LeBron isn't the point guard. I don't know. Who cares? It doesn't matter how the lineup is constructed. KG just moved LeBron out of the way. He was a little, little boy in that possession right there. Look at him just move, Bron. KG built 
absolutely different. Get out of the way, little boy. And that's a bucket. And that brings it to a three-point game. I'm happy we did jump into this one, man. It's good. It's, it's a close one. Just give, I don't want I want to see LeBron with the ball, though. We haven't seen Brian get a touch at all. There it is. These two players going back-to-back. -back. It's a vintage Dawkins game. LeBron with a pull-up. Great defense from Kevin Garnett, who, if I'm not mistaken, has one defense player. Maybe I'm running things together. I don't really know. Allen Iverson gets stripped by Chandler. Greg Anthony is above. They didn't give him the ball. McCarthy said he wants to be selfish and, I guess, shoot some clock a little bit. Yeah, that's like it was going to... Nope, not shooting the clock. We're going right at other... The AI in this game is so ridiculous. But I don't know. Big moment right here. As Allen Iverson is getting the clamps put on him. The absolute clamps. Who the heck is that? I don't know who that is. Who is that? What the block? Marty Chandler. Marty Chandler has to be the greatest defensive. A plus defense. Yep. Okay. Makes sense. Marty Chandler? Auto generated rookie? Small, I mean, not small for a shooting guard. All right, big possession right here from the Celtics. Blocking foul. Six foul. We're going to the free throw line. Marty Chandler, Allen Iverson has 32 tonight and eight assists. So I was going to say Marty was playing good defense, but obviously not. Allen Iverson is having his way out there. And he's going to bring it down to a one-point game because Allen Iverson is not going to miss a clutch free throw, right? There's no way he misses a clutch free throw. So I need to see LeBron do something. I need to see LeBron do something. There he is. Give him the ball. Yes, let him close this one out, man. Bring the ball to the court, being guarded by Kevin Garnett. Moves to the left, going straight for the basket. Spin around, turn around, fading jumper. LeBron James put it in, making it a three-point game with one shot clock remaining. That is a crazy shot. That is a crazy, crazy shot right there. One-legged spin a Rooney jump shot clutch shooter? All right, they need a three. I mean, I guess they don't need a three. They can play the foul game. But let's see how they decide to do things, man. See what they decide to do. They get it in over there to Chauncey Billups, who's wearing 2K generics. I don't like that whatsoever. Screen comes from Kevin Garnett in a row. They got the big man switched on to Greg Anthony. Give him the ball. Or don't. They're looking for three there. They're looking for three. And he airballed it. Wow. They had, I thought that they should have went. Personally, I thought that they should have went with, like, the switch when Greg Anthony was being guard or guarding Kevin Garnett and got the easy bucket and then played the foul game. You do got LeBron on the other team who was prone to maybe miss a free throw or two. But now two free throws are made, and this game is over. The Toronto Raptors live to see another day because once you go down 3-1, it's, it's going to be tough to come back. Um, Kevin Garnett was a minus 25 in this one, and LeBron was a minus 11. So... Plus minus. Might not mean a damn thing. And this was domination. Wow. It is a 3-2 series. Kevin Garnett and Allen Iverson have been ridiculous. AI, hey, uh, what do you... He's averaging 31 in this playoff run. And KG is averaging 28 and 14 and 6 with two and a half blocks. He's shooting 58% from three for some, some reason. Um, KG decided he wanted to be an elite three-point shooter. All right. Come on, Bron. Let's, let's, let's force this game seven and it like they will. That's that's not even close. Game seven at the TD Garden. I mean, maybe it's not even called a TD Garden. Maybe it is. I don't really know. Game seven. Here it is. And it looks like the Raptors are winning this one. They're up by too much. There's no coming back from that. LeBron is back in the finals. I forgot Jalen Rose was on his team. LeBron puts up 32, 6, and 7 with two steals in the block in the elimination game. And they're going against the seven-seeded Houston Rockets who have Cedric Oliver, who is elite, I guess. Sam Cassell is still here. Why am I doing it like that? Sam Cassell is still there. Cedric Oliver, Cliff Robinson. They got two Cliffs. They got Clifford and Cliff. When's the last time two people named Cliff were on the same team? I think this is another championship. I don't think that team matches up well against us. Game one is a win. I mean, it's been a great ride for a playing team to make it to the finals, but I don't think they have. I don't think they have it. I don't think they have it, y'all. I don't think they have it. LeBron was here for four seasons, and it looks like he's walking out of here with two championships. Now, I do want to be there for the last one, maybe. Or do we have to? If it's close, we will. And it don't like it's close. You already saw the championship animation. Believe me when I say. He's got another one and another finals MVP. Great. Okay, I'm excited, man, because doing this was super fun. And it makes me want to go back and doing a complete 
re-simulation of the NBA from 1995. Leave a like and subscribe if you want to see that. That was a ton of fun, man. Um, I will see y'all tomorrow with another banger of a video. Hit the links in the description. Go to the other channels because we're dropping bangers all across platforms for 2022. And, man, this was a W, man. It was a W.